He drives it forward for uh, West Perth, but at the back it's all South Fremantle. They clear it out to Ditchburn. Ditchburn on this member's side. Up towards Turner. Turner spoiled. Comes to ground. Watmore. Watmore just inside the boundary line with that kick. It's taken by King. King grabs well by Turner. Pulled to the ground. I don't think he could get rid of that. Yes, he could have, according to umpire Scroop, holding the ball to decision and the kick to go to Turner. Greg Turner. What a dynamo he's been in this third quarter. Sends it up to the true wing position. Ball comes off hands. Edwards knocks it out in the direction of Flugi. Flugi picks up. Sends a handball into the centre. There's Geary for South Fremantle. Geary has all the time in the world and finds that uh, player there in Derek Collard. Derek Collard just inside 50. Drops it onto the chest of a teammate. That is Stephen Jackson. And Jackson in the goal square just shrugs his jumper and says, get off me, Mr. Biffin. This is another goal to the Bulldogs coming up. We're at the 22-minute mark of this third quarter as we await Stephen Jackson's kick on goal. <laughs> Bulldogs doing as they please in this third quarter, yeah. making up a large deficit free to, tell him you don't get to West Perth. <laughs> as Jackson comes in for yet another goal to the Bulldogs. There's the kick from Stephen Jackson. He's waving his finger saying that one's through. Bounce down back in the centre. Oh, up goes Nelson. He collides with a South Mantle opponent. And here comes Managlio. Through centre half forward to the 50 metre line. West Perth lead inspiring now. And that's the one to do it for the Falcons. Coast to coast goes Peter Managlio. He's going to try and fire this team up now. West Perth moves to 12 goals 9. South Fremantle are 14 goals 12. Oh, O'Neill caught one in the head, not seen by the umpire. Breaking away with the football now is Riggs. Up flies O'Neill. He's taken too high. Play on calls the umpire. A chance here for um, that player in Sadowski. Sadowski's handball goes to O'Neill. He can't pick up. Knocks it out of the pack, but South Fremantle will work it away now. That's up to Collard. Collard knocks it cleverly back to McDonald. McDonald kicks forward. The pack flies. No one can pull it in. Matera's down there for South Fremantle. Gets socket out of that pack to by Djakovic. Djakovic goes to the 50 metre line. Pops it toward goal and Edwards. No, Jackson. Great mark to Stephen Jackson. Both players look mighty similar and they're lurking down in the full forward area. Both very solid builds and short dark hair. So Stephen Jackson right on the goal line. A chance to put South Fremantle even further in front and they're running away with this game. They currently lead by 21 points. There's the kick from Jackson straight through the middle. Nelson and Edwards. Edwards wins it down. It comes to Fimino. Fimino sends the ball forward. Pack flies, comes to ground. Here's Holden. He's died a natural death since half time. That's O'Brien. O'Brien into the centre. A chance here now for, um, for Williams. Williams, a sloppy little kick up toward full forward and a good diving attempt there from O'Neill is unsuccessful. O'Neill picks himself up off the dirt, drives toward goal, and the Falcons have finally put a major on the board. Jackson gets a handball out this time to Djakovic. Djakovic wheels, puts it up toward full forward, the pack flies, ball comes to ground. That was a good chance for Geary there as Watmore clears out for the Falcons to King. King played a good game since he's come off the bench. He in turn gives it to O'Brien. O'Brien down the members' side. Ball bouncing freely in no man's land. Oh. Through comes Nelson. Can't pick up the football. And it goes over the line for a boundary throw. A couple of minutes out of time on in the final quarter. Boundary tap won by Edwards to Brad Collard. Handball over to uh, Matera. Matera uh, to Ditchburn. Ditchburn, half forward, sends it toward full forward, and a great mark taken down there by South Fremantle. Can't quite pick up the player. And it's Geary. Richard Geary, a number of the South Fremantle players look very similar in this fading light here at Leaderville Oval. In comes Richard Geary. There's the kick from Geary, straight through the centre for the Bulldogs. South Fremantle with a 12 goal second half coming home right over the top of West Perth to run out winners by 43 points in that match yesterday.